and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World The Game, where today you might think I sound a bit weird. Well, guess what? You're right! <laughs> I've just recently came back from the dentist, and my bottom left jaw is like all numb. I can only feel half of my tongue. <laughs> and I was like, you know what? How many times in my life is this going to happen, and uh, am I going to be able to record it? So, <laughs> I'm just hearing myself. Oh, wow. Oh, it's so weird. Anyway, guys, <laughs> welcome to this special episode. Oh, my God. Uh, yeah, this is going to be interesting. I like it. I like this a lot. <laughs> so, um, yeah, the new hybrid came out recently. It's, uh, whoa, I didn't even know what it's called. Sarazinosaurus. Ooh, okay. Now, a lot of you guys told me to buy this, like, last night. Uh, when it when it was first released, because um, oh wow, the more I've talked and moved my mouth, the more numb it's went. <laughs> I think I've moved the stuff around. Oh wow, oh this is gonna be a fun episode. <laughs> okay, okay. All right, let's get the free thing now. Because um, this is a really good hybrid. Um, I actually already have it because. It was on sale. Well, it wasn't on sale. It was just kind of like really, really, really cheap. So if we look at, um, we got a market, we got a hybrids. It's still 19,600, which is crazy cheap. That 19,000 is on par with, it's 10,000 less than Indominus. And like, if you look at Indominus' health, 5,430 health, 2,074 attack. Now we're expecting less than that, right? I checked it. It's quite a lot. I'm not gonna spoil it because it is a lot of bird. He's over here and I already have um, four of them already hatched. I do have um, more in the incubation labs, but here it is at level one. It has 1,653 health with 632 attack, which is crazy good. It looks interesting. I, I just kind of wish that it had um, Longer claws. I mean, they've made the claws as long as they could have with the animation because if the claws were any longer, it would be stabbing itself. Um, so I feel like if they had a unique animation, then they would make it longer. Oh my god. Wow, I didn't think it was going to be this bad. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, it's going to be good. Okay, so let's see what we get. Claim reward. Okay. The, the Cerizinosaurus, there you go, is a hybrid of a Thera. What? Therianosaurus? You forgot the Z there, guys. Oh, well. Also, I, I, like, I cannot feel anything, so I've got to be careful, because if I bite down on my gum or my tongue, oh, that's like a horror story. Jesus. I, it would just be bleeding everywhere. Like, I, I remember reading something somewhere where, like, um, some parents had a, had a child that couldn't, that, like, couldn't feel. So basically, it was numb. So one night, they, they... Oh, God, sorry if you're eating or anything, or if you're going to find this, like, terrible, because it, it is a bit, actually. Um, they they uh, heard laughter from the crib. Uh, can we can we darken the screen and have spooky scary? There you go. They heard, So they heard laughter from the uh, baby's room, and they went in. And uh, when they went in, or at least the mother or father, one of them, um, they found the uh, the young child had bitten off his thumb and blood was everywhere and it was just laughing to itself because it couldn't feel pain. Oh, it was like, ah! <laughs> and, and like, this reminds me of that. It's like, oh, it's like, did you know you can bite through your little finger? You can probably bite through all your fingers, but like, just like you bite through a carrot, it's basically the same. Ooh. <laughs> oh boy. Anyway. Oh God. Oh. Right, we have 63 million food. Um, I'm expecting us to get up to a level... Well, we can get level 30 with this. I don't know about level 40 just because I only have 4,000 bugs and we've got those in. And I'm not expecting to speed them up, so we're going to get to level 30 and then in another episode, we'll get to level 40. Just because I can't speed those up, I'm not spending any more money on this because I, I, you know, I have VIP and everything. So let's get at level 10... It has 2,480 and 947 attack. Oh, wow. I kind of like the look of this creature. The domes are kind of okay and the horn as well. Uh, so let's get another one to level 10. And there you go, evolve. And it's already, already to speed up, it's 120 bucks. So it is quite expensive. Um, oh, God. Oh, boy. 
This is gonna be. This is go oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, the, by the end, I, I probably can't even afford to um, speed one up. Cause look at those bugs. So, oh god, I bit there, but I missed. I heard my teeth clench. <laughs> I just gotta keep my mouth open this whole time. Um, so, yeah, I like last night. I was expecting it to be fixed pretty quickly. Cause it will be. Don't worry. Um, oh, there you go. Look at that health and attack. 3, 000, at level 11, 3,215 and 1,228 attack. Whoa, that's crazy. Yeah, so last night I was expecting this to be fixed, which is why I bought all of them straight off the bat. And I've still got 97,000 DNA. Now, there's a part of me that thinks that Ludi have done this deliberately. They've deliberately put it out cheap just to be like for people to be like, oh, play, play, get it really quick, get it really quick. Like, play the game. Um, because, I don't know, I feel like when they do things bad, everybody, like, spreads it around. But when something like this happens, it seems like it's accidental. But I, I honestly don't think it is. I feel like they've done that deliberately. Uh, level 20, there's 4,248 health and 1,623 attack. And it is a carnivore, strangely enough. Um... It kind of looks like it'd be an omnivore, if anything. So let's claim those rewards. Oh, we didn't get anything for that. Senizor so, sorry, Zenizinosaurus. Yeah, is that it? So, Sa Serazin. Yeah, I'm right. <laughs> or Horn Rake Lizard takes its name from the Ceratosaurus sharp horn and the raking claws of the Serazin. Uh, sorry, Thera. Th th I can't say it. <laughs> there is an source. So there it is at level 20. Uh, let's get these guys up to um, level 20 as well. I can, like, you have to bite your tongue pretty hard in order for it to hurt. So, I'm pretty good. I could stick my tongue out. <laughs> that could work. And then I wouldn't definitely bite my tongue because I could feel it on the right side. So weird. I'm really lucky. I've had three sort of fillings recently. Well, two real fillings, one cap. It's basically just a little bit of decay. Um, and, uh, yeah, really good. Like, no pain. Uh, like, they, they have this numbing gel that they put on the gun before they get the needle. Like, the big gun thing. Um, and I just felt a little bit um, today. That, but that's the first time I've ever really felt, like, some pain. Um, oh, oh, I like the colorings. Ooh. Yeah, so we'll not get this at level 40 today, but at level 30, it's going to be in the top 20, 100% for sure. Wow, yeah, my chin is completely numb <laughs> on the left side. Oh, look at this. I thought, yeah, I thought record today because it adds a little bit of flavor to the recording. So how much books is it? Uh, 162. Ooh, God. Okay, please tell me there's going to be some good events. Please tell me. Well, there you are. There it is done. A level 30 and then a level 21 it has. How much? 5,236 health and 2,000 attack. Not bad. Oh, look at it there. Oh, beautiful. Okay, and what is the claim rewards? Don't even know, but we got about like 50 bucks. Created by InGen, Serizinosaurus has both feathers and scales inherited from each of its so-called parents. Ooh. It looks really cool. Oh, God, nope. Yep, yep, that's what I wanted to. It looks really cool, though. And at level 30, it has 6,476 health and 2,473 attack. Oh, look at it there. Yes. So, yeah, that's probably what Paki, Paki Gallosaurus was before it got the buff. Because that got a major buff. And there it is. Uh, but when we can't... Yeah, I'm just going to leave those in. It's going to take six days. Uh, whoa, look at all those. More stuffies. As well. Ooh, three as well. <gasps> Let's claim all of those. Going to need the food. <laughs> if we have a level 40, it'll definitely uh, eat all of that food. So what do we have? Ooh, wow, look, the Jurassic, <gasps> Jurassic Park 25th anniversary. I was wondering, like, this looks really cool. I love this. What, like... They have all these assets, and it's only a little bit of Photoshop. There it is. Look at that. They do move in heads. But we also have the pack to win as well. So, oh. Oh, okay. So card one, card two, card three. Oh, this is a great pack. Discover Jurassic Pack. Pack. Jurassic Park 25th anniversary only has a Ankylosaur, but you will definitely get it, and you will get a load of books, and that's, oh boy, that's what I need. But before we do anything... Let's, can we, how do we do this? Do we have to go in settings and then scan, is it? Set, oh, hello, hello. Can I scan? Oh, I can't even scan. Wait a minute. Can I not do that anymore? 
How do you, how do you, how do you scan things? Because I wanted to get the camera up. Look at that, I can't even click settings. <gasps> That's so weird. Look at the mess which is my table. <laughs> like we've got, what is this even? This is an old battery uh, for the flashlight that, um, what do you call it? Uh, that Ellie Sattler and Robert Muldoon use in Jurassic Park. It's the original old one. It has like an original, like if you push that, it tells you how much charge it's got. But I think the battery is dead. The entire battery is dead. So that's a shame. But it's just been there for years. <laughs> but look what I found today. Uh, one of my, uh, a person I bumped into at Smith's told me that Phoenix have them. Yes. Oh, and Grady. Finally, we have some human characters. How, oh, here, thank God. And I was like, oh, yeah, I'm definitely going into town to pick those up. So you have, you have Blue and Owen there. That looks pretty nice. Although one thing I've got to say about this, because I will do a review on these, um, is the back of the box is bloody boring. That's the first time that I've seen, um... Uh, like the back of the box looks so dull like no there's no like extra people like you know all the other characters that you can collect or dinosaurs it's just it's uh, it, uh, it should be made by Mate uh, Hasbro sorry <laughs> the way that looks so we'll put that over there and then also another Owen Grady except for he comes with a force field shield and some body armor by the looks of it uh dinosaur trainer Owen so yeah don't really know what they're um they're planning to do with that, but the the piece de la resistance is this guy over here. You ready? Uh, the mercenary, the mercenary and ankylosaurus. That's not an ankylosaurus. That's like whoever proof checked that. My God, they did a pretty poor job of that, didn't they? That that is a demorphodon. Um. So, <laughs> I actually, I don't think I'm going to open this one. Just because I feel like that's a collector's item. I feel like um, they're going to be recalled, or at least uh, the next wave that go out, they're going to have that fixed. And these, these were, this, car, this guy right here would be a limited edition run. Like, well, he won't be even a limited edition. He'll just be a, an error sort of pack run. So that's uh, really interesting. I'm probably going to buy maybe... You know, I got some money to, to, to spend on toys. <laughs> yeah, I'll probably buy like two more just to say, like, just in case. Like, what happens in the future if they cost, like, you know, if they sell for £100 each? I'd be like, hell yeah, for, for spending an extra 20 quid. Heck yeah, I'm going to make 200 <laughs> But anyway, back to the game. I do also want to go on record saying that they probably won't cost, <laughs> like, two, they probably won't sell for 200 So this is Welcome to Jurassic Park. I kind of hope this is a new battle arena. Oh, oh god, doorbell, two seconds, guys. That was quick. No, I'm not interested. Bye. <laughs> oh, that's weird. Huh. I mean, I guess it is the visitor center, but what would be really cool is if this battle arena, like, for the 25th anniversary, like, what if it was the, like, imagine this, the visitor, <laughs> I can't even talk because of this. <laughs> numbness. Um, what if it was the visitor center? There you go. Uh, but it was before it was destroyed. So it was like in the era of Jurassic Park. That would look so cool. And it'd be like, oh, it'd be a little unique thing. Or have it on the planes where like you have that classic scene with uh, Alan Grant, Ellie Sattler and uh, John Hammond with Welcome to Jurassic Park. That would be awesome. Awesome. There's my keys. Put them down there. And there's one done. And 50 DNA. Second battle. Ooh, who should fit? Look at that! Level 30 and it's better than Indominus. And it cost 10,000 less DNA. You know what? I kind of want to buy more. Because if it, if it does get fixed. If it does get fixed. Now hold on. Hold on a second. I've just had an idea. Mmm. Now let's say, how much does it sell for? That would be interesting. Um, but I can't really check. I should have checked that before I fuse them. But let's have a look at the market. Now, when you sell something, it sells for half the price, right? Right. So if this guy, because if you look at we'll, we'll see what level 40 is, it's around about the same as you done. So really the price of this creature should be 70,000 DNA. 
So if I spent all, if I invested, <laughs> here we go. Here's a business strategy. If I invested all my DNA in Cerizinosaurus, and it does uh, get its cost back, like put correct. So let's say it costs seventy thousand. And I sell the five um, ones that I bought. So I buy five for 20,000 DNA, right? Then I keep a hold of those five. It gets fixed and then I can sell them for over 35,000 DNA. So I make a profit of 15,000 DNA if for each one. So if I was to buy five, I would make what, like loads? I'd make, yeah, I'd make a fair bit of DNA off that. <gasps> well, you know what? With that in mind, I'm going to buy one. Um, and then can I buy another one in the market? Or does it just say hatch? Damn. Damn. Um, huh. If in six days it's not fixed, which it will be. Well, I've made some investment. <laughs> I've got one ready to hatch. But anyway, back to that. And you guys can follow suit. If you've got like loads of DNA... Uh, go ahead and buy one. Um, and if it does get fixed, you'll make a profit of like, you know, 20,000 DNA or like 15,000 DNA. Uh, so what should we have face? Ooh, how about an Indominus level 30? Yes. I like how this has got a little smoke. And then Labyr is it Labyrinthosaurus? Labyrinthosaurus, that's right. Okay. And then these guys are only level 40. Huh, interesting. I really feel like maybe I know Ludia are putting loads of effort into Jurassic World Evolution not Evolution sorry Alive <laughs> the Pokemon Go version um, so they're sort of splitting their workforce between Jurassic World the game and Jurassic World Alive as well as all their other games that they've got going so I can understand that they didn't have time to maybe make a unique battle oh god Ooh, bit me tongue there. <laughs> I can understand that they, um... Yeah, once I've recorded this, I'm not talking anymore <laughs> until it wears off. Uh, but yeah, I could see why they didn't have time to do it. So, for the final one, should it be Cerizinosaurus? Hmm. Hmm. It's kind of a waste, though. These are really easy dinosaurs to face up against. Even so, I think a T-Rex could kill all of them. Shall we try it? It's a Jurassic Park event. Let's see if a T-Rex can kill all of these creatures. This will be interesting. I just gotta get lucky though, that's it. I just need to get rid of Ankylodocus and then a Patasaur has like no attack. Okay, I can kill it in two. He's got a possibility of two block. So I have to go for four. One, two, three, four, and then two reserve. Oh, that's good, that's good. He's only gonna have four, I think. He might have five. Um, but look at that, 132. Does he have five? He, oh, he has four. That's good, that's good. Come on, I can do this. We can do this. Oh, he went for three. Yes. Okay, he's got one block. We have six. Uh, one, two, <gasps> three. Fucked in that one. And then I have to go for... Uh, I could have went for one block, I think, here. But I did, uh, maybe three hits would have killed me. So how much attack? Two, four, six. Ooh, yeah, three hits could have killed me. So, oh, oh no, <gasps> he's gonna kill me. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, you know what, we tried. We did really good there. If we had survived that. Yeah. <laughs> if we would survived that, uh, we would've won, uh, of course. Uh, but, uh, you know, so Soprano Titan, there you go. A quick victory. But look at that, you can do this with um, a level 40 T-Rex. Well, to be honest, I put in one dinosaur. If I had anything else in there as well, we could have won that. I know, right? What am I doing? Ooh, oh, that was lucky. He could have killed, uh, sorry, no, could have killed me. He could have survived there if he went for one block. And you, my friend, Dippy, can't do anything with four. No, you're dead, yes. One, two, three. And, oh, bless it, it tried. Oh, no, it's alive! Never mind. It's okay. Ooh. Ooh, you got five now. Are you going to go for it? No, he doesn't. Okay, is he going to block for four? He blocks for two. Bless it. Bam! So, give me that Ankylosaurus. Or Ankylosaurus. However you want to say it. So, this is it. I discovered Jurassic Park. So, is it going to be, like, for this week? Or... For the month? Are we just going to have like different packs? Because I'm pretty happy with that. That's not too bad. 50 bucks is a bit meh. But to be honest, we didn't face up against really hard creatures either. And you know what? 60 is better than nothing, I suppose. 
Um, and we'll do the battle stage infinite where we will now use Sarah's Inosaurus. Um, then Metrophodon, and then a Cygnus, which is my god, we need a miracle with this. <laughs> um, oh, look at it, it's proper zoomed out. Oh, I like it. Should I go for one reserve? He can kill me in two hits though, so I'm gonna go I'm gonna go for a block. Can we do this legit? Oh, he switches out. Oh, 8,900! Oh, he did eat. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um, I ah, oh, This is ridiculous. I'm going to go for two. Okay, yeah. I just wanted to see. Oh, God. Just wanted to see what he did there. And he's going to have three. So that means that uh, Sarah, <laughs> Sarah Zinosaurus is well and truly dead. Um, so I might as well just go for two reserve. And he's going to go for a full on three. Now, now, this will be interesting because it'll be up to, I could switch in to Segna Sutures. I've got five, um, but I don't think I get too much extra. If I switch out, um, that's kind of wasted because um, I will only have four goes after that. I'd rather have five, go five turns with Metrophodon or the rather than four turns with Segna Sutures. So I'm going to go for one, two, three, and then go for two reserve. Because he's going to have uh, Press the Suit just come in and then he's going to switch out straight away. Come on, I can play this. I can play this right. Switch. Switch your buggy. Yes! Okay. Where are you going to go? Don't go for one. Don't go for two. Go for nothing. Yes! Oh, this is working perfectly. Okay. Oh, he's going to have uh, six. No, he had nothing. Okay, four. I can, I can live with that. Oh, no! Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, okay, all is not lost. We're still good. Because we do have, like, almost 5,000... <laughs> Me numb face. Right, one, two, three, four, factor in... Oh, God. Oh, no. Um. Wait a minute. I think we've lost. That kills it, right? But then he's gonna... Ha he might have one block. And even if he doesn't... Hmm. And Presto Suit just has... It, oh, wait, did you hear that? You can hear the rain. If you listen really carefully. Oh, that's really nice. It's a shame there's no water splatters or rain rain splatters on the floor. Um, but, oh man. I think we've lost. We don't have enough health to take one hit. I don't think so. You know what? Let's give it a shot. Please don't block. Oh, he did. Okay, uh, so he would have survived that, and we've definitely lost. So, oh, no, is it possible? I could bait him. I could bait him into going for all-out attack. You know what? We'll see. I think we may be able to do this. It depends what attack um, Press Suit just has. Okay, let's go for it. So there it is. He's going to have four. Can we die in one hit? Ah, you buggy! Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Um, oh, no. I think he's going to go for four anyway. Is it his go? Yeah, nah, there's nothing we could do there. That's ridiculous! Come on, Ludia man. Fix those infinite battles. I've got, like, the best hybrids, and there's nothing I can do. He's going to go for four anyway. Yeah, he would have done that anyway. I just thought maybe I could catch it before he got to go. But, um... Look at that. Segna Sutures, Metrophodon, and the latest, um, Serizinosaurus. Um, but nothing I can do. That is ridiculous. Oh my god. And look at Pachygalosaurus's recharge time. <laughs> Four days! It's probably like five days or something ridiculous like that. What else do we have? Um, we've got the Rarity Rumble. Um, ooh! Hmm, that seems a bit tricky, actually. And we've got these ones, of course. Uh, but yeah, anyway guys, I just wanted to showcase the uh, the, the newest hybrid because you guys wanted to see it It was it was in the comments of like the mystery pack thing. I just did yesterday I was like there's a new hybrid. So I thought why not? I've just been injected. I can't feel me fierce <laughs> Let's do it. So if you enjoyed this video guys leave a like and until next time I'll see you later where we will of course get a maxed Serathinosaurus or at least depending if it's a week if it doesn't mean a week maybe not but uh, bye bye <laughs>